these dictics don't really interest the predator. They're too quick, too alert at all times and ready to hop off. Instinctively, these little gazelles are very attentive. It really looks like the end is near. The young oryx has risen, exposing itself to an imminent attack. In this situation, all options are bad. All its strategies are pointless. Of course, its instinct should tell it to move away from the lioness. But if it moves, particularly if it begins to run, it will trigger the lioness's predatory instinct. The predator seems so sure of herself that she can hardly be bothered to start the chase. The little antelope can't get very far. At this point, the lioness seems to hesitate on the strategy to adopt. In any case, for the time being, she has given up the hunt. She prefers to wait in the shade, as if she's certain that the little antelope will be back. The lioness's intuition was good. The next few minutes will show she was right. But no Dick Dick alive has ever seen what will happen next. The little oryx has unexpectedly come back to where the lioness is waiting. But what is still more surprising, instead of attacking, the lioness is behaving like a mother. On the one hand, there are the natural parents who are clearly incapable, and on the other, an adoptive parent full of unnatural attention. Who knows how the story began? What could the lioness have in mind? How did the little herbivore become attached to its worst enemy? Why are those paws protecting and caressing instead of dealing a fatal blow? Survival in the bush entails compliance with codes and behavior that is supposed to be instinctive, transmitted at birth along with the animal's genes. That instinct spontaneously leads prey away from the predators and predators towards their prey. The real strategies can be learned later. These Grant's gazelles can hardly count on their father to teach them survival strategies. He is really interested in their mother. For him, she has become just another available female.
Impala babies don't get a lot of consideration either. After spending the first few days with their mother, they're all sent off to daycare. <laughs> 